Hi, for this video, we have another work problem. Um, for this one, this time, they gave us that working together, Lisa and Shauna can sweep up a porch in 5.65 minutes. So this time, they gave us the time working together. Um, had she done it alone, it would have taken Shauna 10 minutes. And how long would it take Lisa to do it alone? So this time, what we're looking for is I'm going to let X equal the time for Lisa alone. And what we're going to do is we're going to set up a rate for each person. So we would have Lisa is going to be 1 over X because we don't know how long it's going to take her. For Shauna, if she were to do the whole job, it would take her 10 minutes. That means that she does one-tenth of the job each minute if she's working at a constant rate. And then together... It took 5.65 minutes. So we would set it up this way. And then remember that what we would do is we would be do the part by Lisa in one hour plus the part by Shauna in one hour equals the part together in one hour. Um, or sorry, in this case it would be minutes, not hours. The last one that I did um, had hours in it. So I would do 1 over x plus 1 over 10 equals 1 over 5.65. Um, so the first thing that we would do is try to get rid of fractions since it is a rational equation. Um, so our LCD is going to be um, 10 times 5.65 times x, or we could say 56.5x. And then what we're going to do is go through and multiply each of these individually. So when we multiply each one individually, the first one, I'm going to just write it as 1.65x times 1 over x. Plus, on this one, I'm going to put it as 10 5.65x, just because of the fact that that way you can see that the 10s just cancel out. And then on the last one, I'm going to write it the same way again, 10 times 5.65. You can leave it as 56.5, but it just makes it easier to see why I'm canceling out what I do. So with this, if we go through, on the first one, the x would cancel out, so we would just be left with the 56.5. On the second one, the 10s cancel out, so we're left with 5.65x. On this one, the 5.65 cancels out, so we're just left with 10 and the x. And now we would just solve the equation. So the first thing that we need to do is get all of our x's on one side. And we end up that with 4.35, and this is not going to be an exact answer, so we are going to have to round this. And so we end up with x is approximately 12.9885, and since it says to round to two places, um, we could say that it takes Lisa... approximately 12.99 minutes to complete the job alone. So with this, if you wanted to put the context in there, you could say that it takes her um, that long to it takes Lisa that long to sweep the porch. As always, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please let me know. Um, if you have other topics you need me to cover, please let me know that as well.